So Vivid Sydney in 2016 is the biggest Vivid we've ever had. We've taken everything to a brand new level with the best light artists from around the world and the best light artists in Australia participating in Vivid. We're setting a new standard. We're lighting the Opera House, Customs House. We're bringing Taronga Zoo and the Botanic Gardens to light like they've never seen before. And not only are we lighting the city, we're also encouraging a new generation of people to embrace innovation and those important STEM subjects at school and right across the innovation boom that's here in Australia. Well, Vivid Sydney really is the perfect event. It drives tourism into Sydney and regional New South Wales, it generates jobs, it reinforces Sydney's position as the creative services hub of the Asia Pacific, but most of all, it brings joy and happiness to everybody who participates. It's a must-see event, and that's, I think that's why people keep coming back year after year. So top tips for Vivid, come earlier in the evening, come earlier in the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, take public transport. We have over three and a half thousand additional services for trains and buses over the 23 days of Vivid. I'd also suggest downloading the Vivid Sydney app and going onto the website, vividsydney.com. It will give you all the information and uh, definitely plan on more than one night. There's so much to see this year. I think you'll need a number of nights. Plan ahead and have a great Vivid Sydney. This is our hundredth year, so Taronga's been a part of Sydney for a hundred years and it really is an icon. So what better way to celebrate than to have Vivid at Taronga Zoo. So this is actually really, really important for us. It's really the start of the celebrations for our hundredth birthday. So we're very proud of it and very excited. As part of our 100th anniversary, we really wanted to make a difference. So we committed for the next 10 years to focus on 10 species, to turn around their plight and let them thrive in Australia and in a near neighbour, Southeast Asia. So of course, those 10 species were a wonderful inspiration for the lanterns that both the children around New South Wales have built and the key lanterns that are the iconic pieces throughout the light walk around Taronga. So it's very special, it's got important messaging in it and we hope everyone comes and joins in the celebration and by doing so actually helps support our work on this in the future. I think it's really special that an iconic hundred year old organisation like Taronga can link in with something as contemporary as the Vivid Light Show Combining art and culture with conservation is a very nice mix, I think. Having Vivid Sydney here at the Royal Botanic Garden is a great way to celebrate the 200th anniversary of the garden. The garden is not only a spectacular location on Sydney's doorstep, it's also an important leader in science and conservation, in food security, in biosecurity, in climate change adaptation and so on. So it's great on that 200th anniversary to recognise not only what a spectacular location this is for millions of people who visit it every year, but also that important science and conservation effort where the Royal Botanic Garden is a world leader. Whilst Vivid's able to showcase Sydney's great creative talent, it also provides an opportunity in 2016 to really celebrate two of our great city institutions, Taronga Zoo turning 100 years and our Botanic Gardens also turning 200. They're centrepiece locations in Sydney and they're going to be one of the new additions in Vivid 2016. Make sure you get down to these fantastic locations, enjoy the wonderful animals at Taronga Zoo and experience the Cathedral of Light here at the Botanic Gardens. They'll simply blow your mind. The Garden of Light is bringing our botanic gardens to you at night. It's lighting up the existing collection and creating something that's never been seen in Sydney before. So when you come into the botanic gardens for this exhibit, you'll see the Cathedral of Light, you'll see the trees lit up, you'll see our garden brought to life by these electric artists.
Well, Vivid Sydney is the world's largest festival of light, music and ideas. And being able to have the University of Technology Sydney embedded into this year's Vivid sends a really strong signal across the Asia Pacific about how strong creativity is part of the New South Wales and Sydney economy. It's also showcasing the creative and innovative talent that our fantastic university students are showing all over the city. Vivid's now in its eighth year and we're going from strength to strength and we're showcasing the next generation of light artists, making sure that right across the world, people who are inspired by what happens in Vivid Sydney can look forward for the years to come. We have an absolute visual feast at Central Park this year. It's Central Park's second year and we have a spectacular projection called X Factory on the uh, facade of the heritage listed Carlton Brewery, which explores what it's like to be an X Factory um, and explores disruptive technologies, the rise of computation, the rise of the robot. Also this year we've involved the students from um, University of Technology Sydney and they're providing again a wonderful collection of uh, individual pieces from the first year students, second year students and the master students of the uh, animation course. It really is a spectacular evening.